We all know that our vehicles damage the quality of the air we breathe. But have you ever stopped to think that your vehicle's tailpipe is not the only source of pollution from driving? Harmful pollutants are emitted when the fuel you use is pumped from the ground, refined, and transported to your local gas station. Perhaps you fill your tank up with ethanol. Well, the tractors used to grow corn pollute the air too, as do the facilities that ferment and distill corn into ethanol. Maybe you're on the cutting edge and have an electric car. The electricity had to come from somewhere, from coal, natural gas, maybe even a wind turbine or solar panel. Our research uses models to understand how the pollutants emitted in the production and use of the different vehicle fuel options available to us affect the quality of our air. One thing that we found is that electric cars are better than gasoline cars if the electricity comes from renewable sources or from natural gas, but not if the electricity comes from coal. If we're going to use natural gas, we found that it is better for air quality if it is burned to make electricity for an electric vehicle than if it is burned directly in a vehicle engine. We also found that because growing corn and turning it into ethanol creates a lot of air pollution, using it is worse for air quality and health than gasoline. If we also consider the impacts of these fuels on climate change, we find that ethanol from corn grain is still worse than gasoline, but ethanol from agricultural residues such as corn cobs might very well be better than both. So if you're going out today to buy a new gasoline powered car, we recommend the most fuel efficient vehicle on your list. If an electric vehicle is an option, that's great, but only if not much of your electricity comes from coal. If you don't know where your electricity comes from, now is a good time to find out. Life cycle air quality impacts of conventional and alternative light duty transportation in the United States. Written by Christopher W. Tessum, Jason D. Hill, and Julian D. Marshall.